Douglas Park School is one of four new build schools within Regina Public Schools and part of our 10 year renewal plan. Uh, it has had a positive effect on the community uh, in that there's been a resurgence within some of these uh, older communities and newer families moving in. It's also part of a larger network of 21st century schools within Regina Public Schools and part of our structural innovation program. During our community engagement in Douglas Park, including best practice workshops and design pattern workshops, it came through loud and clear People were ready to move from a model of isolated classrooms and corridors to a learning community model. The school is organized around a central heart, and surrounding that central heart are three learning communities, a pre-K through two, a grade three to five, and up above on the second floor, a grade six to eight. Each of those learning communities has its own common area, and those common areas connect to the central heart. enjoyed the new building and um, it feels so much like home that the first few days of uh, last year we'd have people come in and they'd be sitting in the learning commons on the soft seating like they would in their own living room and um, not realizing that this is also a classroom and so the building just made everybody feel welcome and drawn in. The school is um, unique, I think, in that um, there are parts of the building that are open and exposed, so students can see an elevator going up and down. Students can see what's behind the walls and what's in the floor. The teacher and teacher was an interesting um, relationship. When we were in the old building, they were very much in their own rooms and would go to the staff room for prep time. Now that we have our collaboration rooms, you see a lot more of the co-teaching and co-planning occurring. They really like the collaboration spaces and most of them will tell you that that's one of their favorite parts of the school. I think the great thing about having this space for all of us teachers is it brings, it bonds us together on a friendship level, which also helps us work well together as a team, because teaching is as a team. So we support one another when we have things that we're looking for advice for, or we could give advice, or problem solve, because that's what teaching is about. So I think having the space to do that doesn't break us up, going to class to class to find each other, but we have lots of different people to choose from. concentrate when it's like loud yeah. you can come in here and you can it's Separate way more quiet from yeah yeah so it's kind of like another room but it's still you're still in this classroom yeah. I like this space this this as I said every time I walk in I say wow I feel so fortunate to be able to work in this space Ah, it's amazing. I when you know it's still dark when I come when I come and and the light against the snow is is breathtaking. And then when you come inside and you and again you're in the light. I uh, it just feels like like you're like you're outdoors but you're indoors. The solar wall uses the heat of the sun to warm the cold winter air as it enters the building. Solar power. One of the things that the community had asked us for is if we could put the park back into Douglas Park, which is what you, uh, why you see some of the symbolism here within the school and certainly on the, uh, on the exterior, on the site itself.